Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some popper slivers. And oh my gosh, is this... Wow, this was up for my last video, too, wasn't it? <laughs> I didn't even have nice slivers up there. I had pioneer slivers up there. Oopsies. My bad. Um, yeah, so if you watched Monday's video with Burn, <laughs> he'll know what was happening there. I just had my wrong thing up. Um, I'm going to keep this. I'm going to keep this. We don't have our forest yet. But as soon as we get one, it's GG. And we've still got a plated and double sinew. So I'm going to keep this. This is still pretty strong. We'll pull into our green eventually. We've got more green. Playing against uh, Yuktosa. Abundant growth. Uh, gives us a second to catch up a little bit. Sidewinder out. Go ahead. Oh, Scott, what? What is this? What am I up against here? That's nice. We just need to pull into what we need to pull into. Can attack into this sky fisher. I don't know what's, uh, what's exactly... What deck is this? Green, white, black? I don't want visionary. Sure. This is some jank, dude. If I've ever seen it. What is happening? I really want to pull into a forest. I mean, I'll take that. Sure. I'm not going to complain about another lord here. Keep the pressure on with these sinews, man. Holy crap. I'm gonna make the game work without uh, a forest in sight. Another abundant growth. All right. You got four mana. What are you gonna do with it? Anything? What are you ramping to? That's what I want to know. You know what card I'd love to see in Popper? Rotting Regisaur. <laughs> what is he, a 6-3 or a 7-3? Uh, in order to keep him on the board, you have to discard something from your hand each turn. But he's like a 3-drop, right? I think I think that would be a really cool card to have in uh, in Popper, honestly. Crypt Rats, what are you doing? What are you doing? That's not going to help anything right now. No siree. Oh, it's not going to help at all. Gemhide can't really do anything with that right now either. I just got another lord. What you want? Let's get in there. Come on. Yeah, you you're, you got to make some blocks now, man. Goodbye, Skyfisher. We're literally about to make this work without any green mana. Of course, this is just like utter jank right now. Okay, ephemerate, huh? So you block and then you ephemerate. Fair enough. So you're playing for some ephemerate stuff here. It's interesting. And they returned abundant growth. And they're going to return him to get another card draw. Sweet. That's interesting. I don't really know what the key thing here is, though. I mean, they're digging for answers, but... Alright, they found a swamp, so they got two, but that's not going to do it. 
They can do three. They need like another abundant growth. Uh, but Llanowar has summoning sickness, so... In order to kill all our stuff, they would have needed to have him not have summoning sickness, play like another abundant growth on this, and then they could have tapped like all four for swamp. Uh, but I think, I think they failed in finding what they needed. What else could they do? Anything else? I don't think so. I think we're in the clear here. Rock solid. And next turn, we're just putting down a plated. Must they kill a lord? They kill a lord somehow. Yeah, no matter what, I think they're they're in a rough spot. Chainer's Edict. Um, okay. Well, that'll keep them surviving for a second. Oh, there it is. Oh, man, finally, right? Jeez, I'm just going for major power here. There's no need, no reason to mess around. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, hmm. What a deck this is. What would be good? I kind of just want to run it back. I don't feel too scared about this deck at all. Maybe a Spinneret? Just to block a Skyfisher? Maybe they've got more? They're mostly green-black. They're mostly Golgari colors with a splash of white. I wonder if Gleeful Sabotage would be worth it. I'm just going to run it back like this. Try to get some more information on the deck, I guess. Well, we can't keep this. Hmm, that's, that's rough. Keep this. And we're going to dump a land. Say done. Call red with the thriving heath. Turn two, we can go Viverland striking. Oh, that's beautiful. We're in good shape. Strong hand. Go ahead. We're playing around edicts like this too, which is nice. I just want to know their main game plan here with this deck. Like, they got ramp, but we didn't see anything that they're ramping into. They got Crypt Rats, main deck Crypt Rats, which is a bit awkward. Uh, maybe it's not awkward, but... Huh. If you're a mono black, you run main deck Crypt Rats for sure, but... Uh, but you are not. You are trying to ramp into something. And I am curious what you're trying to ramp into. I want to ask him. Give him a little compliment. See if he uh, wants to share the details. Because now we're seeing blue. So now I'm really confused. <laughs> I'm really confused now. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Alright, we're getting more land, so... If we draw another land next turn, that would be sick. Just drop double lords on him. He might be trying to respond to me right now. Alright. Two twos with first strike. Let's go. I don't want to miss this chat if he chats me. Bring it over here at least. Alright. Killing the Land of War Visionary. He don't want no smoke. He doesn't know... Maybe he doesn't realize it's first strike. I mean, he's got to, right? I would take the four here. We're not presenting enough damage to where you just lose some of your, your ramp. 
Now he's pausing a lot. I can't tell if he's like trying to respond to me or if he's just like figuring out if he should have blocked or not. <laughs> This is weird, though. Weird deck. If you haven't already, guys, leave a like on the video. I appreciate it. Uh, make sure to subscribe while we're waiting for our opponent here. I'm trying to get to the 1K mark. Trying to maybe make a few bucks on the channel since I'm uploading daily all the time. It'd be nice to just... I know I'm not going to get a lot, but <laughs> it'd be nice to just get to that point. It opens up some more opportunities for me to keep growing. Uh, so if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I appreciate it. Um, he is still just waiting. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Snuff out. Uh-oh, we got a blowout here. That's rough. That's rough. It's actually rough. Good play. All right, snuff out's in inbound. Got to watch out for that now. Now we definitely need another land so we can just drop two lords. Get back in this thing. That'd be nice. Don't make me edict my Viverlint. You cruel, cruel man. Or woman. Yuktosa. Just like, everybody's trying to like, make decks around mono black control. Like the, I've, this isn't the first time I've seen this. People run like all these main mono black control cards and then just splash in all these, on all this other like random crap. Just play mono black control. That's what your deck is trying to do, it seems like. Like ramp out super mono black control by splashing green and blue. Like what? Blue? Blue? What? I have no clue. <clears throat> Skyfisher. All right. Fair enough. They can go for some more card draw here. Snuff out, man. Snuff out strong. Swinging in with visionary. All right, sure. Feel free. Give me a land, all right? What are you doing? You want to go to attacks? All right, land. Yes. All right, we're back in business here. <sighs> I'm not going to attack now. I'm going to wait till we have a backup lord on, on base here, just in case I got another snuff out in hand. Which would be pretty nasty. I don't want to use, lose my Viverlint yet. Crumbling Vestige, huh? <clears throat> For black, like... You're playing so many colors. Oh, goodbye board. That sucks. They're making it work this time. Are they going to pop this thing right now? Looks like. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, board. That's rough. Alright, well, we... This is a good recover. This is a good recover, I feel like. <clears throat> uh, it'd be nice to get some refill. Maybe a winding way. Winding way would be nice. Oh, damn, Thorn. Thorn? You're playing with Thorn? Dreamstalker? What the hell is this? This is the jankiest jank I've ever seen. Like, what? What is happening? Dreamstalker? You play that in... 
Acid trip. This ain't acid trip. Maybe it is. I guess it could be. They got Skyfisher. Is this acid trip? It's acid trip. Dude, I'm tripping right now, bro. This is acid trip. Four color acid trip. I've never seen Acid Trip play with so much removal outside of Reality Acid. Wow. Okay. That's interesting. Huh. Acid Trip. I'm going to be taken out by Acid Trip right now. Because now they are set up. Now they just start going. I'm holding Forest in hand. I'm not playing it yet. Yeah, that makes sense why they got the Ephemerate now. They used it to draw another card, though. They didn't use it... To hit Dreamstalker. Maybe they'll hit Dreamstalker now. There we go. Alright, comes back in. Returns. Goodbye, Muscle. Navigator's Compass. Have you guys seen this deck run all this stuff before I don't think I have maybe I should have seen it a little bit easier but this black was what was really throwing me off so okay so I've seen acid uh, acid trip run abundant growth we know they play blue we know they play green dream stalker sky fisher ephemerate makes sense but this black, like they're playing with Crypt Wrap, Snuff Out, Thorn of the Black, and Land of War Visionary. It's very interesting. Very interesting. Wow, my phone's going off. Well, we are crap out of luck at this point. Now we're just drawing land. All right. I got five cards in hand. I'm not. I'm not sitting in this game. Let's uh. Let's figure out what we need now. So now I want pyroblast. I want gleeful. I can cut the spinneret. I don't really need it now. Cut a winding. I don't. Do I want hunter? It does help with crypt rats. I think I just want like pyroblast and the and the, and the gleefuls. So what to take out here? I guess Hunter. I think we I think we can do fine with cutting Hunter in this matchup. I need to cut one more thing. Kinda want Sentinel in the deck still. I want the gem hides. Predatory. Virulent striking? I can see cutting striking. It's not super relevant either. Hmm. <clears throat> I do like it though. Let's run it.
<laughs> the guy's like, finally answered me. He's like, full co four color acid trip. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I see that now. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Can't keep it. Can't keep it, Frick. I'm going to lose on these mulligans right here. This is going to be unfortunate. Oh my gosh. Holy Frick. No freaking way. <laughs> oh, help. That's so bad. Oh my gosh. That's so bad. Ah. Oh. Is it even possible to recover here? Like at all? I'm just going to run gem hide. We're just going to go gem hide because we want like extra mana. Oh my gosh. We mold to three. You guys saw those hands? They were garbage. I've no, I don't think I've ever mulled to three with this deck. That is... Alright. Alright, we're going. We're trying. We're out here trying. I have my doubts. <laughs> this is going to be rough. We need like... We need a refill right now. Dreamstalker already. Sweet. They already got the Dreamstalker. And a snuff out. Okay. Um, I think that's Murder, She Wrote. A winding way. Okay. Well, we got a winding way. That's great. We're going to take our time to do that right now. Okay. All right. We're back in it. We're back in it. Maybe. I mean, this is also allowing them enough time to really get set up. And this already seems like they have a better start. Like a way better start than they have the last couple of games. And Crypt Traps. <sighs> yeah, but. <laughs> We're chatting it up now. Because <laughs> I said, well, GG on my Molta 3. And then he said, GG. And then I. <laughs> He just responded to my winding way saying, OMG. And I said, yeah, but Crypt Rats. <laughs> um, we'll call red just in case. This is where it gets rough, man, because anything I play that can Crypt Rats out, I guess I just play a Lord. So I play a Lord. They could still Abundant Growth and then pop it. And they don't know that I have another lord. I guess that's my best shot to try to set up with like a gem hide. I go sinew. <clears throat> Next turn I go gem hide. <sighs> into a my couple two drops or something. Yeah. We may just lose this guy, but <clears throat> it's uh it's rough with this crypt rats out here. We need to we need them to chill out on land or something. Uh, and they could just go acid on us too at this point, you know, abundant growth, uh, slam down acid. The best way to win against acid trip is if they don't have acid trip in their hand. That's what I've noticed. If they don't have it to start and they're just trying to card draw into their acid trip then you you have a good shot but this crypt rats is annoying another dream stalker pop back abundant all right so they've only got two sources of black right now all right all right okay all right this is this is reasonable i'm just gonna throw down lords and try to outrace their crypt rats we can empty hand next turn. Abundant growth, draw a card. Freaking acid trip, this is gonna be a long game now, huh? <laughs> I might make him, if I can find a good image of him, I might make him the cover. 
We've seen him more than we've seen Acid Trip. Reality Acid. Whatever you want to call this stupid card. What did I just do? Oh, Bajuka? Okay. Well, they found another Swamp. That's not great. But we do have another Lord. This is all about racing the... Oh, did they find another... So oh, you can do this. Alright, so they pop now. Yeah, alright. Okay, they found a way to get a, get through it. Uh, this guy's the thing, right? Yeah, until end of turn, target land you control. Yeah, that was a good draw on them. Uh, we had a chance to race, but now... Now it's gonna be... It's gonna be rough. Do what we can. I mean, this is still a board. This is still good, but they can block two of our guys. And again, it's like, look at their mana now. This is just reality acid all day long. We need another refill, basically. Oh my gosh. Just chatting it up a little bit. Oh my gosh, yeah, this is this is R.I.P. for sure. That's rough. Attack! Go for it. <laughs> I'm I'm just like basically conceding here because this is a this is a waste of a game a little bit. At this point, I I don't think there's a way to come back from. Omen of the Dead, Rip, cra uh, rip Crypt Rats. They could pop it now and kill everything, which they should. I'll stay for one more turn, just want to see what we draw, but uh, yeah, it's not like it mattered. They can just untap anyways and kill our stuff. Um, yeah, just do it. Why not? You got the mana for days. Abundant Growth. Attack with Dream, yep. Get that last three points of damage before you uh, snap crack the Crypt Rats. Alright, alright, Reality Acid. Or Acid Trip. You, you got me here. You got me. It was a fun game, though. I popped it for four just for funsies. Okay. Oh, they were trying to get max value on me. That's right. All right. Well, that's a good game. Good game. See if he responds, but uh, I'm going to concede here. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. Uh, Acid Trip taking us over. Leave a like. Let me know what you think about the game. That was a fun one. Uh, they, they didn't really show up until the end here, but they managed. Uh, but yeah, leave a like if you did enjoy, and yeah, stay tuned for more Slivers coming up next week. We'll see you guys in the next one.